What excites me and also the people in the group is that our field of two-dimensional materials gives rise to a lot of discoveries. My name is Frank Koppens. I am the leader of the group Quantum Nano Optoelectronics. The group looks at two-dimensional materials and how they interact with light. Two-dimensional materials are a new class of materials that are only one atom thick. And the beauty is that we can stack these materials on top of each other in any configuration we want. And we are building completely new functionalities and devices with these materials. On one hand for basic science and discovering completely new properties. And on the other hand, we also develop applications from these uh, devices that benefit uh, society in many different ways. So here I have two layers of graphene. Now they are stacked on top of each other and it looks like graphene. Now I start rotating and you suddenly start to see a pattern emerging. It was even discovered that for a specific angle, this is called the magic angle, 1.1 degree, for this specific angle, the material becomes superconducting. One of the unique things here is that uh, we have established the program called Q-Twist. This is a large international program where we are building joint laboratories with other institutions and universities. Q-Twist has a very strong internal program consisting of multiple groups where different expertise is combined towards a common goal. So for example, for two-dimensional materials, we need different kinds of tools and different groups are specialized in these different tools. And we even have joint laboratories where we do this research uh, together. This is a vision we share in the group. Many of the group members are really excited about discovering new things. I was very excited from the fundamental investigations that we had. And now we are taking this towards application and this is due to the fact that we can lead to sensors based on 2D materials for detecting very small gas concentrations and also for wireless data communication. My research interest is the material QED, so basically pushing light matter interaction to its extreme limit and being able to control quantum materials with it. We're really lucky here to have some of the most cutting edge equipment. Uh, accessible to us as, as researchers. We have very, very strong collaborations all over the world, both with the best universities in the US and in Europe. And with these, we can have exchange programs. I think I'm going to MIT, and then you can go to Max Planck in Germany, to University of Pisa in Italy. ECFO is a unique place in the sense that we have laboratories where we can build unique type of equipment. Some of the experimental tools we use to investigate these materials are unique in the world. ICFO offers a lot of flexibility to work on topics we want. This field in which we are working is changing very rapidly and because of this freedom we have the opportunity to move in a different direction, find you know, one of the new branches and apply our unique tools uh, to completely new material systems that have you evolved in this field?